consistent on YouTube I ended up getting divorced so that was really hard on me and then with moving you know downsizing my livelihood all of that was like really hard however for this particular video I am going to be showing y'all how I do my hair now because y'all all know I did cut my hair off no I did not cut my hair off because of my divorce so, most of y'all already know, I went to cosmetology school, graduated, all of that. For me, hair, makeup, fashion, it's all a, it's all a self-expression to me. It's self-expression. It's art. I love it. I honestly been wanting to cut my hair off for like the last, I want to say, four and a half years. But when I brought it up to my ex, he was like, no, I prefer you with hair. And to be honest, I don't think a lot of people thought I could pull it off. And he was one of those people. He he did not think I, in my eyes, in my opinion, he told me the nicest way possible. I don't think you could pull it off, but little did he know I'm that girl. Go ahead, show y'all how I touch up my hair. I know the last video I posted, um, my, how I touch up my color is pretty much the same. However, I do use a different toner. And all of that now, so the techniques are a little bit different because of my setup, y'all. Y'all gotta work with me until I figure this out. So I have a mirror here on this side, and then I also have my laptop here where I can see myself to make sure that I'm in focus. Okay. Y'all see that? So right now my hair is kind of like this dirty blonde. Um, what has changed, I got leftover gel and stuff in it right now, so it's hard to comb through, and this actually hurts. Um, what has changed is, I started cutting my own hair now, so that's changed. I look like, fight the power right now. So... <laughs> This is the back. I think I think I am going to go ahead and cut it because I like my back to be flat. So, um, I'm going to go ahead cut my hair. To bleach it, I'm going to use BW2s. And I'm out of 30 volume. All I have is 20. So I'm going to use 20 volume developer. And then I also have my color corrector. So I'm going to use purple color corrector drops. And that's going to help cancel out the yellow tones and orange tones that my hair is going to pull. So that's it. So more than likely, I'm going to have to do two bleach processes. So, I'm going to be using the 20 volume for both processes because I'm literally almost out of the 30. And then, it's probably going to sit for about an hour. He couldn't make it. We try to get all Tupac, Shakur. He couldn't make it. We tried to get all of soul. James Brown, he said, help me. He couldn't make it. So, it has been an hour. Yep, it's... About to be seven. As you can see, my hair is yellow, golden color. So I already know I'm going to have to do another bleaching process. But that's what we are looking like so far. 
So I'm going to go ahead, rinse this out. And when I rinse my hair, I'm going to rinse it out in warm water. Really warm water. You do not want to rinse out bleach in cold water. You want to rinse it out in warm. So I'm going to rinse it out in warm water. Do one shampoo with my shimmer lights. And I'll be back to do another bleaching process. Y'all, if you wear glasses. Put them on. I missed a whole freaking patch in the back of my head. Because when I went in the mirror, I was squinting the first time, holding it up, applying it, and I never checked. And I missed the whole freaking patch. So once I get done with this whole process of bleaching, I'm going to have to do this whole patch again. Because I missed it. Wear your glasses. Just wear, wear your glasses. That's it. That's that's it. Okay, y'all. So I went ahead, shampooed my hair, all of that stuff, and this is what we are looking like. So I did two bleach processes. So now I'm going to go ahead and go in with the Wella, the Wella T11 toner. Then I'm going to use 20 volume. Okay, y'all. Okay, so this is what my hair is looking like with the toner. It's been sitting for, I would say, almost about 10 minutes. So, I'm going to go ahead, rinse it out, shampoo, then I'm going to follow up with my conditioner. I'm going to be using the Olaplex um, shampoo conditioner since I did a lot on my hair. And depending on how my hair feels, I may do a protein treatment. Okay, y'all. So, we are back. Um... Focus. Okay, so hopefully y'all can see me. So, while I was doing my hair the last time y'all saw me, my camera shut off. Battery died. Brand new day. We back again because I got to get this hair fixed before 7 o'clock. That's what time my event starts. It is now 1.17. I still need to do my nails. We ain't got time. Right now, my hair is this golden color. It's yellow. I do not like it. So, I'm going to retone it using Wellis T18. Hopefully, y'all can see that. There we go. But tonight we are Jabir seeing it done more. Oh color. You gotta go. So I'm gonna just go ahead and keep watching this periodically, then I'm gonna rinse it out and I will be back to show y'all what we looking like. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, we'd like to let you know tonight that we would have a big pop or he could make it. We try to get Okay, you guys, so here is the final look to my hair. So after I did the toner, I want to say we are, I did my hair. Uh, I retoned it Saturday night, and today is Wednesday. So what, what is about four or five days later? About four days later. So um, I hope you guys like it. This is what we are looking like in the back. Um, now, my hair does normally lay flatter, but um, this is two-day-old hair, so nor I'll be doing the video. Well, let me know if y'all want a video with me showing y'all how I get my hair 
to lay down but again it could be flatter but this is two days old so it's not the flattest at the moment but here is the final look to what I did and I hope you guys like it if you're interested in the lashes I have on these are the forever glam lashes you can go to my store my online store which is www.allthewayglam.com and order you a pair of lashes um, on my lips is my lip gloss as well however it's not available yet but it will be available soon but I hope you guys like it don't forget to head on over follow me on IG TikTok um, and Facebook at Brit Brass Styles. Um, I'm definitely trying to get my IG following up. But I hope you guys like it. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Hit that like and subscribe button if you found this video helpful. And I will see y'all on the next one. Bye.